friends welcome to bank exam cafe today we are going to discuss the questions based on hots that is higher order thinking skills this is the third episode and we know that the questions from hots are asked in the board examination so it is very important to go through all these types of questions because these are higher order thinking skill questions so before starting with the question i request you to subscribe the channel so that the notification of newly uploaded videos will be sent to you and you will not miss any episode of bank exam cafe and if you have already subscribed to it then thanks from the very core of my heart now let us start with the higher order thinking skills based question friends here is a question on the screen in the figure as shown sector oap of a circle with center o containing angle theta ab is perpendicular to the radius oa and it meets op produced at b prove that the perimeter of the shaded region is r into bracket theta plus sec theta plus pi theta upon 180 minus 1 here this is a circle with center o and poa is a sector and theta is the angle of that sector and oa is a radius let this oa be r therefore op is also a radius it will be r and ab is perpendicular to oa and it meets ob if op is produced then we have to find the perimeter of the shaded region this is the shaded region and we have to find the perimeter of the shaded region perimeter means the total length of the outer boundary this is the simple definition so pb ba and ap are this total is the total length of the boundary and so it will be the perimeter so to find the perimeter of the shaded region we will have to find the length of the arc pa then length of pb and then length of ab and together this will be the perimeter of the shaded region so let us find one by one so here let first radius which is equal to r cm and so we will first find the length of the arc pa so length of arc pa that is equal to theta by 360 into 2 pi r here 2 ones are 2 2 180 is a 360 so which is equal to pi r theta upon 180 so the length of pa arc that is equal to pi r theta upon 180 let it be it be number 1 now friends we will find the length ab correct to find the length ab here we know oa so we will take this as the opposite side and this as the adjacent side because oa o sorry a angle is 90 degree so this is a right angle triangle and we can apply trigonometry here so tan theta is equal to opposite upon adjacent that is ab upon oa so tan theta tan theta which is equal to opposite that is ab upon oa here oa is a radius of the circle and we are denoting it by r so it will be tan of theta which is equal to ab upon r 
and so ab that will be equal to if you take r to this side it will be r tan of theta let this be number 2 so here we got the distance ab first we have got the length of the arc pa then we calculated the length of ab now we have to find a pb this distance we have to find so here first we will find the distance ob total distance ob require sec theta so we will take sec theta so sec theta that will be equal to sec theta will be equal to apo hypotenuse upon adjacent side that is ob upon oa and so sec theta that is equal to ob upon oa oa is r and therefore ob is equal to r sec of theta let this be number 3 now we have got this ob distance total and we require pb distance so pb that will be equal to ob upon sorry ob minus op so but pb is equal to total distance ob minus op o correct ob we have calculated here that is r sec of theta minus op is the radius of the circle that is minus r let this be number o now here from 1 2 and 4 here we got the length of the arc pa that is pi r theta by 180 and the length ab that is equal to r tan of theta and length of pb that we have got as r sec theta minus r so here if you add this number 1 number 2 and number 3 we will get the perimeter of the shaded region so here we have to find the perimeter of the shaded region so perimeter of shaded region that is equal to ab plus pb plus length of arc pa so ab is we have got here that is r tan theta r tan theta plus pb that is r sec theta minus r r sec theta minus r and plus arc pa that plus arc pa is pi r theta upon 180 degrees here we can take out r as a common factor and inside the bracket we will get tan theta plus sec theta here r we are taking out common so it will be minus 1 if you take out r as a common factor here it will be pi theta by 160 so i write this first so plus uh, pi theta by 180 and this minus 1 at the end so here perimeter of the shaded region is equal to r into bracket tan theta plus sec theta plus pi theta by 180 minus 1 and that only we have to prove so to find the perimeter of the shaded region this is the shaded region and we have to find the perimeter of the shaded region so first we require the length of pb the length of ab and the length of the arc pa this together we get the perimeter of the shaded region pbab friends i hope you must have enjoyed this video if yes please like the video so that it will inspire and motivate us to come up with more videos please share it with your friends so that they too will get connected with me and get benefited please share your suggestions and emotions through comments because your comments are assets to us thank you very much friends in the description box i have suggested few sample paper books if you wish to buy you can buy on amazon through provided links and that will help the channel also 
so please buy the sample papers if you require through amazon through provided links and also i have provided few suggested links on the videos which i have uploaded previously you can go through it also and give your suggestions and opinions through comment box thank you very much